Hi, today I'm going to be teaching you how to put in clip-on weave. Well, it's not weave, but it's extensions, but people think it's weave, but it's really extensions. First, you're going to need a comb, Morocco oil. You can get this from uh, any, like, beauty supply store. Um, it's only $7.99. And a scrunchie and your brush. Don't forget the clip on. Um, you could get any clip on weave from online for like about 150 to 220, and or you could get it from any beauty supply store for probably more. I prefer online because you could get a discount, you know, you know. All right, first, you want to take three-fourths of your hair and part it right here. Then, you want to grab your scrunchie and put it in a bun. Now, you want to take some of your Morocco oil and put just a tiny bit. Then you want to run it through your hair and stuff so that, um, you know, it doesn't look all dry when you put your clip on it in and then people could know it's your real hair or that. Then you want to, you know, brush it a little bit. Alright. Now, you grab your clip on. As you can see, I had got ombre Brazilian hair. Um, I got it off a website called myextensions.com. I'll put the link under down there. Okay. Now you want to unclip it. Now you want to put it on the part area on top where you had put your hair. And you want to Make sure you clip it on the hair extension or your real hair. Put it on the hair. Your real hair, sorry. Some people prefer to braid it, but I don't really care too much of braiding it. Too much time and you don't have to, you can take your hair out anytime you want to, so... You can wear a natural one day and then long the other. As you can see, it blends in right in my hair. Then you want to grab this hair, your real hair how you that you parted, and you want to part it again to cover the hair extension.
Then you want to put it in a bun again on top. Now you want to put a little bit more Morocco oil. But not so much, you know. Make it look shiny. And run your fingers right through the Brazilian ombre hair. Or your extensions, whatever you want to say. And you want to brush it. To make it blend in with yours. Now, final step. You can part it either way you want. You could part it through the middle to make it look like You can flip it through your hair and make it look just like this. Then you want to tuck your real hair in a little bit to not make it noticeable. As you can see, I have a part right here. You can also do this to your hair, flip it over. Another style you can do is the little, you know, side bang or whatever that girls naturally wear usually with their real hair. Overnight, I usually pin curl this part to get the little, you know, oomph. But Or you could curl it with your flat iron, but I highly suggest not to because it can show your real hair changes color when you flat iron your hair. So it can show your real hair. As you can see, it looks just like this, and it looks just like my normal hair. No clip-in showing or anything. And that's how you do clip-on weave. Any questions or anything, you can, you know, you know my number. Anybody know my number? But yes. Thank you for watching. Bye.